and welcome to my channel. I'm Stacy, and um, this channel was actually <laughs> my daughter Annika's idea and she will be helping me to run things here. Um, I will be running this in conjunction with my bookstagram uh, which is called My Literary Life in Finland because I live in Finland and um, we wanted to start with a TBR video so we will be showing you our books that we plan to read in November. And my son Henry is going to help both of us in choosing our TBR. He's going to help me choose one extra book because I already have 10. Might as well add another. And he will be helping Annika just choose her entire TBR. So uh, let's get started. The first book I'm going to be reading is one of my own and it is Mapping the Interior by Stephen Graham Jones. I started reading Stephen Graham Jones a few months ago and this month we'll be reading Mapping the Interior, continuing um, over on She Was Only Evie with Evie, um, her Discord. Uh, not much of a horror reader, but Stephen Graham Jones has been solid so far, every book I've read. So I'm excited to continue with his works. Another book I'm reading that I own this month is a fantasy book, um, Illborn by Daniel T. Jackson. This is a carryover from September. I paused all of my September reads in order to have a spooky October. And so I will be picking up right where I left off in this one and finishing it up hopefully this week. It has been pretty decent so far. It is a debut. And I think it's supposed to be a series. I'm not sure how many books are going to be in the series, but so far it's been pretty good. So I am uh, excited to continue on with this book and see where the series goes. One of my most anticipated reads of the year, which I finally got in the mail, is uh, Empire of the Vampire. Not Interview with a Vampire, Stacey. Empire. Of the Vampire um, by <laughs> Jay Kristoff. Uh, this has been anticipated for a greater majority of the year and I'm really looking forward to getting into it next week. Now I have a few buddy reads that I am reading uh, this Super month on several monkey. different dis Super Monkey on several different discords. The first one being Jade War by Fonda Lee, reading it over on Gregory LaPerta's Discord with Anitha Gade and several other people. We read Jade City this past month and it was so good. So we are all um, excited to be continuing on with Jade War in anticipation for Jade Legacy in December. Another buddy read with Kate from the Literary Apothecary is Bloody Rose. By Nicholas Ames. Kings of the Wild was really, really good. I loved it. Gave it five stars. So I'm anxious to continue with the band series and read book two, Bloody Rose. Another buddy read with Jake from Bookish Drummer is Stephen King's Night Shift, which is a series of just short stories. Um, I'm relatively new to Stephen King. I've read three of his books in the past two years, so not a lot. And I am really looking forward to continuing with these short stories, one a week for the next few months, and see where this goes. And I also look forward into discussing them on Jake's Discord. And I will do my best to link all of these below. I am technologically challenged. We'll see how this works. Uh, library books. I am swamped in library books. I have more coming in, so my goal is to get all of these read this month. Uh, one of them I picked up was Starting Over at Acorn Cottage by Kate Forster. I know nothing about this book. It came up with a random search I did. I was looking for a completely different book. I had absolutely no interest whatsoever in this book, but I got it anyway. I am a glutton. For book punishment, so we will see. Another book is The Diviners by Libba Bray, and this one, I know a few other people have been reading it, and um, Stephanie, I believe, from Miss Richard Reads, 
really likes the series and um, this is one that I had to put down but it has carried over so I am reading it and finishing it this month and then continuing on with the series because it is so good. I really really enjoy the series and I will be adding it to my collection most likely next year. Some YA books that I have that I will be reading from the library are Fox by Nadine Brands. I don't really know anything about it except that it revolves around the 5th of November and everything that happened with um, the, I don't know, I'm not British, what was it? The gunpowder treason or something. The little V for Vendetta. Guy Fox happening. Anyway, I think one of the main character is sick and he has to help with the, um, <clears throat> or is told that he has to help with the, um, plot involving the parliament building in order to be cured. So I'm not 100% sure if that is correct or if any of that is correct. I guess I will find out, and I will come back later and let you know. But it does sound really interesting, and I do look forward to reading it. And last but not least, I will be reading The Empire of Dreams by Ray Carson. Again, I do not know anything about this book, but it is one that looked like it would be fun, so I got it. And I think... I'm not 100% sure. I would say it's YA, but I... Hey, Hannah. I don't know. But I will read it, and I will... I will read it, and I will let you know. And hopefully I will be able to discuss it without little giggles in the background. And now, if Henry would like to come and help me choose one more book for my November TBR. Hey, no, I'm like you. I will be letting him pick a book, only one this month, from my TBR jar, which in actuality is, not yet, which in actuality is just a Moomin mug and not a jar, but TBR jar sounded really neat, so we're going with that. Moomin mug, TBR jar. Henry. And today's. Oh, today? No, no, no. Let's flip it over. Oh, this one is an anticipated read for me. Let me find it. Blood Meridian by Cormac McCarthy have been added to the November TBR. Thank you, Henry. Daddy! Daddy. <laughs> yes, thank you. So my final book for the month of November is Blood Meridian. And this will probably be the most intense book that I read for the month. Now, Annika, would you like to come and share your TBR, which Henry will be helping you with? Yes. Oh, yours is um, the bear. This yes. This is not okay. actually hey. Annika. Yes, I am technically not the child. I am her, um... Person that's taking yeah. over. It's her brother. It's a brother. Oh, okay. This is yeah, her brother. So I this get is this mug. Monica brother. I get this mug. And her uh, um, big brother. Uh, take the piece. You better not take two. I actually then got a lot. So today is one. in the next. So yep. I'll just open it for you. Okay. So, take the bag. Okay, let me read. This is right. <laughs> Looks like I'm getting one in a poo. Looks like Annika's getting one in a poo. I am definitely not Annika. <laughs> yeah, Annika's getting one in a poo. Let um, me just fart. Wait, it's on top. It's upside down. <laughs> And I do not know anything about this weapon. I only know it's going to be I only know that it 
it's when it. <laughs> she only knows that it's only Winnie the Pooh. And now it is I Kate, Annika, <laughs> and everyone who watching this. Knock knock. Who's there? Book. Book who? The book you're reading about. Enjoy the bee.